So today we're gonna actually answer a fan question from Dogtrot13 said, good to watch one of your videos, Connor, glad to see the channel is growing. Also, I had a question for a certain topic. Is it wrong to be attracted to the same gender, both or all? Thanks again. Well, let's answer that question. So the first thing we need to get out of the way first is the fact that attraction does not equal sin. See, a sin is considered a disorder affection of the soul. But just because you're attracted to something doesn't mean you're sinful in the same way that being tempted by the devil or God allowing the devil to tempt you is also not sinful. So we have to take that out of the equation because at the end of the day, who you are attracted to is not the sin. See, God, see, I have 100% of the belief that for some people, God created them to have a certain cross. If in some degree, it is same-sex attraction and honestly that's a really hard life to bear like if you have same-sex attraction like that's a really hard thing to live with especially if you're a Catholic and you know like you have that and you can't really get married you can't do a lot of things in the church and a lot of dioceses actually will say that if you have same-sex attraction you're unable to enter the priesthood so if you do suffer from same-sex attraction first off I'm praying for you really hard and I'm not saying that it's like it's an illness it's just a part of how God made you as a certain person now I'm not saying the person who asked the question does have same-sex attraction I'm just pointing a fact out I'm say it one more time because it's so important. Attraction does not equal sin. Just like I'm attracted to cookies quite often, not in a sexual manner, just because I really love eating cookies. But that doesn't mean that I'm gluttonous, it just means that I like cookies. Now eating too many cookies would lead to the sin of gluttony in the same way that there would be a sin in same sexual actions or same sex marriage. So those are the actual sins of it. If you actually have a same sex attraction, that's not a sin. But following through is the problem. And I have just as much of a problem of people who have same sex attraction having sex as I do people outside of marriage having sex because neither are aligned with the natural order of creation. Like I said, sin is a disordered affection of the soul. It's a disordered way that our heart is leaning that causes us to do actions that are sinful. So really, it's a simple question. If you suffer from same-sex attraction, is that sinful? No, it is not. Just like I said, it's the performance of the action that creates the sin, not the attraction. And we should stop ostracizing or trying to make straight those brothers and sisters who suffer from same-sex attraction or who have like, oh, I I'm attracted to both genders. Instead, we need to be praying for them, not as if like they had cancer, but as in the same way that we would pray for any of our brothers and sisters in Christ to be holy. So in answer to your question, no, it is not sinful to be attracted to the same sex. What you do with said attraction, that could be sinful. So thank you everybody so much for watching. If you have any other questions you want me to answer, I would love to do a Q&A on tomorrow's video. So just leave them down below in the comments. Make sure you subscribe to Rise Up Jerusalem so you don't miss an episode. It's of uh, the 365 days of evangelization. And make sure you like us on Facebook so you can follow every single video that comes out and like and share it if you think it's good. Thank you everybody so much for watching. Let's wrap this up. And remember, as it was in the beginning, as now, never shall be. Rise up and live.